Hey, how are you doing? I am Gio. Welcome to the channel. If you are new here, welcome back. If you are not new, and welcome to another music reaction. Today we are go back to some hip hop. I think, I think, I think that's just some classic hip hop. I think. Um, I'm going down the list of greatest songs of all time. I'm at number four hundred and eighty. And I see Biz Markie, just a friend. Right, I've heard the name Biz Markie, I couldn't tell you. I'm assuming it's hip hop, right? I'm assuming it's hip hop. I've got no idea. This could be soul. This could be jazz. Guy could play on a trick guitar. I've got no idea. But I'm assuming. I'm assuming this is um. This is hip hop. The 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 little blurb on the Rolling Stone thing says nobody beats the Biz. An impossibly good natured DJ rapper, producer, human beatboxer, and hip hop personality. Hip hop broke, it, broke big with his ode to the friend zone of his second album, built on a fat beat, plinking piano, and charmingly off key singing. Just a friend interpolates Freddie Scott's 1968 song, You Got What I Need, and he talks about love. Right. That sounds good, right? It sounds like you know, gives me a chance to to get to know some more, some more, um, some more hip hop, right? Why does it say two thousand two hundred though? Marcelo Theo Hall, known as Biz Markey, was an American rapper and singer. So just a friend was his big hit, right? This was this was the song. This was his coming out song. That's what pushed him up. Oh, okay. The Clown Prince of Hip Hop sounds, um, it sounds about a little bit rude, didn't it? Clown Prince. Illness and Death. Diabetes. He needed a stroke. He went a diabetic coma. And he died. Yeah, 57. 57 he died. Right. See, um, it's wild that when you think about these people dying at a young age. That is a young age. Like when you're a child, when you're like a teenager, you think like if I get to thirty, I'm not gonna live to thirty. I'm, I'm gonna, you know, if I live to thirty, I'll be doing well. And you get in your forties, and you're thinking, I still feel young. I still got a life to live. And fifty-seven seems young-ish. So R.I.P. to that man. Yeah, R.I.P. to that man. But you know. I think sometimes when people die, you, you leave us with someone, right? You leave us with that. Like, although that sounds stupid, I have thought about it. Like, if I was to die, at least my kids have got like shitloads of videos in my voice, in my face, and videos. That'll mean something to them. Nobody else, but it'll mean something to them, right? And I've, I've thought about it a lot. I thought about it a bit. I leave in something behind. Like, um, not everyone does. But in SDN, there's no excuse for it. But enough with the morose fucking shit. Jesus. Um, so this is Bismarcky. This is, this is just a friend. Yeah, so let's go. Your mom's is so poor, she went to McDonald's and put a shake on layaway. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're doing mama jokes. They're doing mama jokes. Love it. <laughs> your mother so old, she knew Central Park when it's just a plant. <laughs> <laughs> your mom's hair so nappy, she gotta take painkillers to comb my hair. <laughs> right, my favorite is your mom is so poor. One day I saw her walking down the street with one shoe on. I said, Yo, you lost a shoe. She wouldn't know I found one. Just. Yo, yo, that's yo, 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 that. You, you oh, got what I need, man. Touch you. Oh, it's over that, baby. How about you, How about you? Yo, 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 yo. Forget them girls, man. Forget them girls, man. I have a story to tell you. you tell have you ever it. met a girl that you tried to date? But a year to make love, she wanted you to wait. 
Let me tell you a story of my situation I was talking to this girl from the US nation The way that I met her was on tour at a concert She had long hair and a short mini skirt I just got on stage dripping pouring with sweat I was walking through the crowd And guess who I met? I whispered in the air, come to the picture booth So I can ask you some questions to see if you're 100 proof I asked her her name, she said blah 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 She had nine ten pants and a very big bra I took a couple of flicks and she was enthused I said, how do you like the show? She said I was very amused I started throwing bass, she started throwing back mid-range But when I sprung the question, she acted kind of strange Cause when I asked, do you have a match? I started throwing bass, she started throwing mid-range Yeah so far, so good, right? Um, um, yes, yeah, it doesn't go too hard. It's, it's wisdom and meal. Like uh, the fat boys, right? They're just telling a story without being too, without being like super, super talented, right? Without being like super. The voice, a, a, a hip hop voice, is just somebody who has a story to tell, and the ability to rhyme it. She said, no I don't, I only have a friend Come on, I'm not even going for it This is what I'm going to say You, you got what I need But you say he just a friend And you say he just a friend Work for it at this time. I thought just having a friend couldn't be no crime. Cause I have friends, and that's a fact. Like Agnes, Agatha, Jermaine, and Jack. Forget about that, let's go into the story About a girl named blah 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 that adore me So we started talking, getting familiar Spending a lot of time so we can build a relationship Or some understanding how it's gonna be in the future we was planning Everything sounded so dandy and sweet I had no idea I was in for a treat After Please. this was established, everything was cool The tour was over and she went back to school I call every day to see how she was doing every time that I call her, it seemed to me was ruined. I called the rumor, got picked up, and then I called her again. I said, Yo, who is that? Oh, he's just a friend. Just a friend. Don't give me that. Don't even give me that. Just watch this. You, you got what I need. But you say he's just a friend. And you say he's just a friend. Oh, baby, you. On a surprise visit to see my girl that was so exquisite. It was a school day. I know she was there the first semester of the school year. I went to a gate to ask where was oh, the door. No. Oh, this no. guy made me fill out a visitor's form. He told me where it was, and I was on my way to see my baby doll. I was happy to say. So it's got up in me, right? Um, yeah. Um, he obviously, obviously doesn't take himself too seriously, right? He's obviously just having fun with it. He's not got any image. There's no that gangster poser shit. He's not pulling out guns. He's not talking about blasting people. Even though he's a water car chest girl with a guy. He's not got, I, I'm, I'm sure he's not pulling out an Uzi. I'm pretty sure that's not going to happen. Like, that would, be a, that would be a twist, wouldn't it? But yeah... I, I like it. I like it. It's very um of the time, right? Arrived in front of the dormitory. Yo, could you tell me where is door three? They showed me where it was. For the the moment. Moment. I didn't know I was in for such an event. So I came to a room and opened the door. Oh snap! Guess what I no. saw? I felt a tongue kiss of my girl in the mouth. I was so in shock, my heart went down south. So please listen to the message that I sent. Don't ever talk to a girl who says she just has a friend. No. Has a friend. Has a friend. Has a friend. Has a friend. 
So, ladies and gentlemen, I was biz Marky was just a friend. And yeah, I can see, like, it was a fun little track, right? It was, um, and it was very of the time. I'm not sure I would get, I don't think it would blow up today, right? It's just not what people do these days. It wouldn't get taken seriously. Um, it was, you know, it was a, a simple beat, a piano, in him telling a story about a girl, right? And it wasn't a, like I said, it was um, very soft depth again. Like, you wouldn't see rappers today that as a girl blonde man. Like, wouldn't that happen? Like, because they've got to be the stars of the show, they've got to be the hero, they've got to be a bad boy. Right? And um, I don't think this would get made today because, you know, again, like, you've got to be a G, right? You've got to be a G, you've got to flash money, you've got to diamonds, stuff like that. You can't be getting played by a girl unless you're off at the end of it. Right, but it was very of the time. Back then, I guess, as new as it was, everyone was trying to find their place, right? And there was spaces, and it was... Everything wasn't clearly defined, so you had time to create, like, a space for yourself. Let's create this place and see where we go. Right? Let's see where we go before everything starts sounding the same. Which happens. Right? And then it comes down to... Instead of just having a good idea and going with it, it, you need, like, these days, it, yeah, it's much more about um, image and in, 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 on ability, right? On the, on the voice, on then again, fucking Gucci gang. I'll just, I'll shut up. I've got a thing about how much talent and how much thing you need. And Gucci gang just shuts me the fuck up, right? But anyway, I was, I was Bismarcky, I was... Just a friend, always good. Yeah, it was good. It was a good story. It was a good story. It wasn't much else. Um, but yeah, let me let me know what other vintage hip hop I should do. Where should I go? Who should I be looking at? And uh, thank you for commenting. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the suggestions. Thank you for everything. I appreciate it so much, and I will catch you on the next one.